X-linked dominant, it will not skip a generation. And there are few conditions in orthopedics for this problem. One of them is hypophosphatemic rickets or vitamin D resistant rickets. The other one is Luriwell dyschondroesteosis. The hypophosphatemic rickets is important. I have not seen an exam that doesn't have hypophosphatemic rickets. It is a vitamin D resistant rickets. It's an X-linked hypophosphatemic rickets with inability of the renal tubules to absorb phosphate. Phosphate is down, linked to the PHEX gene, fixed gene found on the X chromosome. It is the most common causes of rickets in the United States of America. If it comes in the exam, look at the three things. The child is short and the lower limbs got bowing or deformity. And the phosphate is low. There will be low serum phosphate. So because the body is trying to compensate for the rickets, so the alkaline phosphatase will be high. The calcium is normal and the PTH will be normal. The parathyroid hormone will be normal because the calcium is normal. So the treatment usually high doses of phosphate replacement and the high doses of vitamin D to facilitate the phosphate absorption. The other one is Luriwell dyschondroesteosis, a rare genetic disorder caused by mutation in the SHOX gene, the short statue homo box containing gene, cause short status and bilateral meddling deformity of the forearm. So if the mother is affected and the father is not affected, then the condition will affect 50% of the children and it will be equal among the boys and the girls. So it will affect the boys and the girls. So if the mother is affected, 50% of the children will get the disease and it will be equal between the children, male and females. But if the father has the disease, none of the boys will get the disease, but all the girls will get the disease. Again, it will affect about 50% of the children, but all the affected children will be the girls. The affected individual have an affected parents because it is a dominant gene. All affected males must have affected mother. All affected fathers have affected daughters and no affected sons. Look at the males. Look at the sons and look at the father. I hope you liked that video. If you liked the video, please push the button like and thank you for listening. This video is for educational purposes only. Please consult your doctor before you make any decision about your medical care.